After making 4 successful and helpful Minecraft FPS boost and lag fix videos for low-end PCs, I am back with another Minecraft FPS boost and lag fix video. But, 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 this time, with lot more experience and experiments, this video will be the easiest and the most efficient way to boost your FPS in Minecraft, no matter which PC you have. This is the whole process from how I got running my Minecraft from this to this. And further in this video, I will also show you how you can play Minecraft multiplayer without any lags and stutters, so make sure to watch the video till the end. This are my system specs and keep in mind that I am not promising that you will get the same FPS as me because everyone watching this video has different PC specs and you will get FPS according to it. But I guarantee you that your FPS will improve than what was before. So, this is Low End Gaming and let's get started without wasting any time. So, this video will help you no matter which version of Minecraft you are playing. Go to your browser and search for Fabric Installer. Download it. Link is also given in the description below. Now open the installer and in the Minecraft version, select the version you are playing and click on Install. Close it and again go to your browser and search for Fabric API with your Minecraft version, click on the first link and download it. Again go to the search bar and search for Sodium Mod with your Minecraft version, click on the first link and download it. Keep in mind your Minecraft version, or this will not work so be careful. Now after downloading these two files, copy both the files, search for percentage local app data percentage and open it. Then go to app data. Roaming Minecraft Mods Paste these two files here. Now open T Launcher. Select the release fabric loader and launch the game. Enter the game. Now go to video settings and here follow me and change all the settings to lowest possible and disable all the unnecessary effects. Changing all the settings, play your game. And Vala, this is how my game works. It gave above 250 frames per second, and it was very smooth to play. Hope you got a good FPS boost. Open the Microsoft Store and search for WinToys and install it on your PC. This is the most safest and easiest way to optimize your PC for gaming. Open it and first go to Boost. Here follow me and do as I do. Turn on Ultimate Performance Power Plan. Enable HAGS and turn a VGS. In Startup Apps disable all the unnecessary applications. Disable Restartable Apps, Background Apps and Activity History. In Visual Settings, Turn on Adjust for Best Performance and Disable Transparency Effects. Under Game Settings, disable all the options. Disable Search Indexing, Delivery Optimization and make sure Network Adapter Onboard Processor is turned on. Now go to the Health section. Here, disable Fast Startup, Hibernation and enable Drive Optimization and Storage Sense. You can use the tools under the Repair tab to fix any issues with your Windows if any. Now go to Declutter, here delete all the junk files and clear cache for File Explorer, Microsoft Store and flush your DNS. And we are so done, now just restart your PC so that all the changes take place. If you want to optimize more of your PC and get even more FPS, then watch this quick video to fully unlock your PC potential for gaming. Link in the description below or click in the upper right corner. Go down in the description below and download the optimization pack. First open the MSI Utility application. Here find your graphics card and set its interrupt priority to high. Click on apply and close the application. Now install the Park Control app and open it. First install the Bitsum highest performance power plan and make it active. 
Click on Advanced and make sure all options are set to 100% and are disabled, then click on Apply. Tick Bitsum Dynamic Boost enabled and we are done close the app, now install the Meme Reduct app and open it. Click on File and go to Settings, tick Always on Top and Load on System Startup. Go to Memory and tick these two options. This app will automatically clean up your RAM while you are gaming. If you want to use this app to its full potential, then watch this quick video it will help you more. Link in the description or click on the upper right corner. Finally on our list install the Wise Game Booster. The best game booster ever according to, to me. Last minute detail. Open it and just click on optimize all and it will literally ready your PC for gaming in just one click. Before playing any game just optimize your whole PC using this app and you will surely get a better gaming experience. So, guys it's time now I will show you how you can play Minecraft multiplayer lag free. For every online multiplayer game the most important component for a smooth gameplay is a low ping. And are you tired of lag ruining your gaming experience? Do high pings and constant disconnections hinder your gaming performance? Say goodbye to those frustrating moments, because I have the perfect solution for you, noping. So, fellow gamers, I know how annoying it can be when lag ruins the excitement of your favorite games. That's where Noping comes to the rescue. Noping is a revolutionary gaming VPN service designed to optimize your gaming connection and reduce ping. Whether you're into fast-paced shooters, immersive RPGs, or intense multiplayer battles, Noping has got you covered. Go down in the description below, or the pinned comment and download and install Noping using my special link. After installing open it. Now here make your Noping account and start your free 7-day trial. Now first let me show the best feature of no ping. Go to search and search for Minecraft. But not only Minecraft, but all famous games like CSGO, Valorant, PUBG and more than 1000 games like this only under one subscription with the best optimized ping for the smoothest gameplay. Now click on select server. Now here you will find many servers. So, listen to me carefully select a server which is close to your game server. Like if you play on Asia server then select a server which is closer to it. Or the alternative way is to select the server with the lowest ping. Try what works for you best. Now click on optimize your game and done. Play your game with the lowest ping possible and with a smoother FPS. But wait, that was just the start. No ping has more useful features to get more FPS in your game. Go to settings. Turn on the turbo game settings. This improves the responsiveness of your keyboard which results in a smoother gameplay. Now click on Boost FPS. Here you will find many settings which will help you to increase your FPS in games. Just trust me and enable all the settings. After doing all the changes, restart your PC so that all the changes take effect. So, gamers that was it. No ping. And hope your Minecraft lag was fixed and your game now runs smoothly. Make sure to download no ping from the link in description below or the pinned comment. See you all in the next video. I've got niche I can't scratch, I'm missing a piece that completes a whole part of me, an open wound scar to see. Everybody come here, gather round, welcome to the freak show, the best in town. What the hell's wrong with me? I don't get a